Hey, what's up guys? I've been messing around with Centurion some more and I've discovered a really really funny combo that you can do in this deck. And it's kind of a three card combo, but I'd like to show you guys. So for this combo we'll need to use Ringo Warm. We'll need to use a combination of any of the normal summons. Or Oath. Or a combination of the field spell, terraforming, and wake up centurion. Let's start with the simplest way to show this. We'll use both wake up and one go on. Really cool three card combo you can do in this deck. We'll start off by setting up the field spell. the field spell effect to discard in a card. Grab in Primera. We'll first activate Wake Up Centurion. To summon a level 8 token. We'll use the graveyard effect of Wake Up to send Centurion Bonds. We'll summon Wango Worm using this effect to special summon. Here we'll go into Barone. And we'll special summon Primera. On Air's effect, to search Trudea. We'll normal summon Trudea, use her effect to set Gargoyle and herself in the back row. Here is, here is where it gets interesting. We'll use the Ringo Worm's effect in the graveyard to special summon to a Twinner token. We'll special summon Gargoyle. Then, we'll special summon to steal this batter. We'll activate Gargoyle's effect in the graveyard to add back. We'll use Dispatter's effect to special summon Ringo Worm. Here, before you Synchro 12, you need to make sure you have Centurion in your grave to activate bonds. So, here we'll use Gargoyle's effect first. Send in Trudea to the graveyard to special summon. Here we will use Gargoyle and Primero to send Crow to the new Centurion arc. Chainlink 1, Centurion arc to search. Chainlink 2, Bonds to set a Centurion card from the graveyard. Here, we'll grab either of the trap, but for this demonstration, I'll grab Phalanx. Now, we'll Synchro 12 using this batter and then we'll go on into Crimson Dragon. This is the funny part. Usually keep your Omni Negates, but here we're using them to Synchro Climb. We'll use the on summon effect of Crimson Dragon to end Synchro Rumble. We'll activate Rumble's effect to reborn Ringo Warm. 
No. We'll use Crimson Dragon's effect first to grab ourselves another Omni Negate. Cosmic Blazar Dragon. Here where it gets funny again. You'll link, uh, your sync or climb with your Omni Negate to go into another Synchro 12. Here you have three options. You can either go to Centrion Legatia, Geomathmic Final Sigma, or Crimson Dragon. If you were to go into Legatia, this will play into Super Poly, so I wouldn't recommend it. So the, the best option and the strongest would be to go to Crimson Dragon. So during your opponent draw phase, you can Calamity Lock in, have an Omni Negate on field while doing so. We'll set the trap. Here we, <coughs> here we could have searched the other trap to use for another Omni Negate, since we already have Crimson Dragon on the field. But I've, I've searched this trap so that I can have another Synchro 12 to make on my opponent's turn. So we'll go in phase, activate Sentry and Arcs effect to grab Gargoyle. We want Gargoyle for this demonstration because Gargoyle can be used to chain block. Or oh, Gatia if we choose to special summon on opponent's turn. And here is where it gets nasty if Calamity isn't banned. We'll use the Crimson Dragon effect. Target Sentry and Arc. You don't not want to target Cosmic Blazar in case they chain Emperor, and Blazar will banish for cost. We'll special summon King Calamity, or if it gets banned, we'll special summon another Omnicate, which will not lose to Super Poly, because they both have the same name. Or we can go into Red Supernova Dragon to banish the opponent fields after they activate a monster effect. Or decide to enter the battle phase, which is unlikely because all of their monsters are pretty huge. But for this demonstration, since Calamity is not banned yet, we'll special summon them during the draw phase. Activate the effect and lock up the opponent from doing stuff. And here is why I set this trap instead of the Omnia trap. To go into another Synchro in case something comes up as a backup plan. Okay, chain will link one primary. Chain link two gargoyle. Special summon both. We will not change this level, but we could if we wanted to. We'll use Primera Chain Link 1, Spell Chain Link 2, to go into Legatia. And this is why we use Gargoyle, because it can chain block Legatia's effect when we use it, Legatia's effect. Here we can add back another Wake Up, because we have Ringo Worm in the graveyard can make another level 2 tuner. So you'll see here, Chain Link 1, Magatia, Chain Link 2, Gargoyle to add back. So we'll just we'll draw and destroy a monster on the field. And this here is a really really cool and funny free card combo which Synchro Clams use in your Omni Negates. Have Ringo Worm. After you perform a Synchro Summon, you can Special Summon up to Token Tuner. If this was in game, but you should attempt to attack me. Again, this could be done with a multiple card. 
you will need to draw a longer worm and a combination of either your normal summons or the field spells in Oath or Wake Up Centurion. You can't have both normal summons for this, so you just need one of the normal summon in any of these. So start with a Baron and go into another negate and just sync our clan from there and go crazy. And this is it for the combo. If you guys have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. Later.